Kane, it is your girl Angela Glory TV. My returning subscriber, I just want to say thank you to you who I really do I appreciate you all. Thank you so much. So, my country people, this video here yeah, now about Bobiski, the woman and the man, lucky, may the Bobiski help. May Bobiski help. So, he helped them for him to talk, say, you know, go feed up again. Based on say the boy, they smoke. They get based on say the boy they smoke, so he can't they talk, they, they they smoke, they do all those kind of thing. Man, he not like, so he can't he can't begin tell they say no one again. Man, they come for his house, he can't carry they come for their house. So he can't they can't live now, can't begin they talk, they talk. Uh, waiting every happen, waiting on every moment. No say our high, no rich sham. He want can't talk, want can't like give us now. You know say we we, we be we be we be follow us. Man, no say no, no the reason, you know the reason for the reason they think say yes, now read truth, but biscuit talk. Now, now, that's all you say. This said they did like this. This said they did. Let me say if he age too much. If he too, if he too old, this woman that can 90 years, 80 something, maybe now suffer, make and be like this. You say you go to go to smoke. You know, if you tell me about the man, the boy, I'll say yes, now truth. Or fish now your house. If they smoke, tell they say, yeah, tell the boy, say, I beg, I don't want me to smoke again for this. My house, I beg. You come here, come. They, they find better life for yourself. You can't you can't look, uh, look for a better uh, life for yourself. No can you can't smoke. You you shut now. Now you get out. Nobody go talk to you. Nobody will tell you say. Nobody will tell you say. May you know. May you not do what today your mind. So my country people are gonna live una make una they see this video. Make una they see everything concerning this video. Before I leave una make una not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I so much do appreciate you all. You boys should stay blessed and. Okay, guys, um, this is Bob Risky. Normally, I will not address this because I've got a lot on my mind. But I'm going to address this. It's going to be a long video. You guys remember Good Luck with his grandmother. The old woman I brought from the village to Lagos to my house. Let me start from how I made Good Luck. Good Lucks did a video on his page and he tagged Bob Brisky that he needs my help. And a lot of his followers were tagging me that I should come and help the guy. I sent him a DM that I want to help him. That what is the problem with him? He told me they don't have a house with his grandmother. They don't have where they sleep. They want my help. Fair enough. So... I asked him, can you come to Lagos? I want to see you and your grandmother. He said, yes, they can come to Lagos. That, but right now, they are so broke, they don't have money to eat. So I asked for his account number. Initially, I want to send him 100,000 naira. But since they were coming like few, few days interval after I spoke to him, I then changed the money to 50,000 naira for feeding for just three days that when they come to Lagos I'm getting listening to him and his grandmother I sent him um, 50,000 there after I posted him on my page a lot of people came to my DM and tell me Bob Risky, this guy is a scammer go and ask Kokun Foundation that he is scamming a lot of people on Instagram so guys as I was saying, I got over 15 DMs that this guy is a scammer. But because I don't want people to judge me, I don't want to judge him based on hearsay that he is a scammer. I still went and heard to buy Good Luck and his grandmother tickets to come to Lagos because I want to listen to him. I want to know what what is the problem so i bought both of them the tickets they came to lagos they came to my house so from the airports they came to my house when they got to my house my mother my grandmother called me and said this guy can't sleep in your house because they are strangers what if anything happens tomorrow don't go and help the one you help they'll lock you up oh. They got to my house 
I I fed them because they were coming from Calabar, right? So I fed them. I changed Mama's clothes. I changed Good Lord's clothes, and I gave one of my friend my car to go and drop them in their hotel. I told him to pay for their breakfast, lunch, and dinner. That was how my friend drove them to the hotel. You know, they freshened up and they slept. The following morning, afternoon, sorry, that this good Lord guy came back to my house to see me so we can talk one-on-one. -on -one. He has smoked. All his body was smelling of smoke, 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 smoke. Even mama, that old woman too, she smoked. They were both, they are, they, I noticed that both of them, both the old woman, both good luck, they both smoke. You guys know me now. I, I was so upset and I was shouting at good luck. I said, you came all the way from Calabar so that I can help you in Lagos. You can't even pretend to me. You can't even wait till you go back to Calabar and start smoking. You're already smoking in the hotel. Even the hotel in Chevron, they called me. That's who are these people? I was so upset. I asked good luck. Why did you smoke? He said, eh, they were cold in the in the room. The AC was too cold for them. Then Mama now asked them to go and buy smoke. God, guys. I was heartbroken. That that old woman and that boy, they are both mama and good luck. They are both disappointing. Like both of them broke my hearts. Okay, I was still fair. I sat good luck down. I said, you want help from somebody, from a stranger. I don't even know you. I'm not your father. I'm not your mother. I'm not related to both of you in any way. I'm only helping. Now, help, I help. Where some of you people are coming to my DM to tell me, but Brisky, you live a fake life. You did not help those women. You did not help that boy. You did not help. You are a bunch of fools. You will not wait and hear from the other side of the story. You just open your mouth. Like, like big. The water born, that is the labor room. I'm talking nonsense, talking trash. Back to my story, guys. I so, I sat him down and he apologized to me. Even the old woman to apologize to me. Then they told me their problem, that they are, they are living in a bush. Where they are staying is, um, is a family house. That's his grandmother's husband's house. That the roof is leaking. So after listening to both of them, they went back to the hotel. They spent about five days in Lagos. In fact, I plan Mama staying in Lagos, not going back to the village again. But Mama was saying she wants to go back. I think because they noticed that I'm getting them one one. I'm catching them. Like, I caught them smoking and all that. So, they were in 16. They were going back the third day. I have a witness. They kept saying they want to go back. I asked Mama, why are you going back to the village since you told me you're suffering in Calabar? She now said, no, that she has two goats in the village. That if she doesn't go back to the village now... Nobody to feed the goat and the goat to die. I'm like, go to die. So, you're here to change your life. You're here to better your life. Why are you going back to the village? She insisted she was going back to the village. Even the people in the hotel were saying that. Mama said she's scared though. When she got to my house, I'm too young to have this kind of, this kind of money, this kind of cars in my compound. That she's scared maybe I'll not use us to do jazz. Blah blah blah. So because I don't want trouble, I don't want the kind of help that will help that they will put a cough in my hand. I said, okay, go back to the village. Let me know when you're ready to come back to Lagos. 
So that very day, I I tried to make everybody happy. Do you get? I I made Mama so comfortable after all those drama that happened between myself, Good Luck, and Mama. That was that. That was that very day. I spread Mama money and I posted a video on my page. You guys know Oye. I spread Mama two hundred thousand naira. You guys remember Oye, the lady in um, Ivory Coast that drew my name on her towel. She's in Lagos with me. And she was there. Luckily, she was there that very night when I sprayed Mama 200,000. Oh, yeah, please confirm that. Hey, guys. I'm Oye. Confirm me. It's nice. Yeah, you gave them 200K. <laughs> <laughs> so I gave uh, Mama 200,000. So the following day, they said they were going back to um, Calabar because of the goats, the excuse they gave me. The following day, I bought Mama and Good Luck tickets to go back to Calabar because they said they have a goat in the village. And secondly, they told me they want to um, fix their leakages in their house. I asked Good Luck, how much will that be? Good Luck said, or I think he said 100,000 is okay. So I gave him another 100,000 separate. Guys, up in calculate it though. 50k before 175,000 tickets for both of them coming to Lagos. I paid one week hotel for both of them. That's about 200,000 plus. 175k back to Calabar. 200,000 money spray and 100,000 extra to fix leakage. Now me bond them. So guys, imagine spending over 900,000 to a total stranger, to a total stranger I met on Instagram. Yet, some of you still come to me and tell me, oh, Bobriski, you are wicked. You do not take care of those mother. You do not take care of good luck. You do not take care of these people. People should fear God though. It is, it is so-called Instagram cloud chasers that you will not want to help somebody. Me that want to help, I will still help. They will come back and give you guys half-baked story. And you will just assume and believe. And have the girls to come to me and be telling me that, hey, you are living a fake life. You should not help those people. You should not help those grandmother. You should not help those good... Is it your money? What happened to you? Can't you help them? I, do you have stroke? That was how good luck and mama went back to Calabar. Remember, I did not ask them to go back. They gave me an excuse that they were going back. And I promised them that, let me confirm the ceiling, the leakages, because that good luck boy, I don't trust him. So the money, the extra one million that I want to give them, cash, I held it. Because I wanted to confirm the leakages. If that boy, that good luck, I fixed it. So today, that boy did not send me video of evidence that he has, he has fixed that leakage. So today, I'm a Yahoo I am an influencer. I work so hard to get my money. I'm not doing fraud. So I must see value for what I am paying for. I'm not a politician, no. After good luck and mama went back to Calabar, I did not hear from both of them. The following week, I saw a message from good luck. Eh, mommy, that money you promised us. Don't forget, though. We are already here. We are so free. He did not show me. He did not show me the, the money I gave him to fix the leakage. He's asking me for other money. So I ignored him. I'm not seeing different messages from people. Hey, Barbrisky, you're a wicked person. You are wicked. You cloud chase with that old woman. Don't you have a don't you have an old woman in the house? You cloud chase with her. Barbrisky, you are wicked. Guys, the long let's cut this long story short. Good luck and his grandmother. Especially that good luck is a very big time scammer. Stay away from him. <laughs> so guys. 
um, Good Luck is in Lagos. This is Good Luck. And Mama is in Lagos. Mama too is in Lagos. So I want them to eat. Then after eating, uh, we'll now talk on what to do. Thank you. <laughs> Mama, eat your food. <laughs> Mama, eat your food. So um, when you are done eating, guys, I will now probably tomorrow morning because it's late. After eating, they need to go to bed. Then tomorrow I'll now talk on what I want to help them with. You know, Mama needs to get a better house. She gets, and he needs to do something to maybe go back to school. He, he needs to do something to. So, guys, I'll update you guys on what I'm going to do with Mama and Good Luck. Okay, thank you, guys. Thank you. Can this one size you? Let's see how one size you. Please put like this. Put it on your sister. It's size of you. Yes. Mm, yes. Mm. Yeah. Mama. <laughs> to size Abby? Yes. Abby? Yes. yes. Just so if you want to wait, you did you open it from here. This is it. That's good. Is it yeah. awesome? for me. Is your phone? Mama, I this one. Mm -hmm. What what do I say? Mm, mama, this one. 